Hello. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ah, good morning. It's the 28th of April 2017. I'm just packing my bags and um, I'm heading down to the lobby and I'm going to be taken to the train station. What a lovely peaceful morning. I'm all packed up and ready to go downstairs. Pretty nice room, but it's time to go. That's the name of the hotel I've been staying at. I'm going to try to quickly do Facebook Live to try to see if anybody's on uh, before I leave the hotel because then I won't have Wi-Fi to my next hotel. Here's the train station. There's people everywhere. I am on the train. Looks like a very nice train. Much better than the Romanian one. I'm having a lot of fun with the language here. Not only did I get a Pepsi, but I ended up with an extra big bottle of Coke as well. It's 6.53. Uh, the train will depart at 7 o'clock and then we're going to Lviv. Some guy walking down the aisle, I think he's going to check out tickets. <laughs> Goodbye Kiev, you're a great city. I spent half an hour queuing up for these, so these chips and twigs better taste real good. The guy next to me has gone to the food car, obviously, because he's been gone for like half an hour now. Okay, we're going through a town called Coroston and we're about 60 kilometers south of the border of Belarus. Not that we're going there. <laughs> they actually have an onboard magazine and they have an English translation too. So I still got two and a half hours to Lviv, so I might have a read for a while. This is the train that I'm on, the 705, and I get off at the second last stop. In half an hour we'll be there. Fifteen minutes from Lviv. The next stop will be our one. <laughs> I better get ready to get off everybody else's.
that's my hotel and a very busy street um, and it overlooks a park unless my room's on the other side of the building but I think it's on the fourth floor and I have to climb up all of these stairs in the dark that's gonna be fun well this is my hotel room in Lviv it's a lot smaller but this is more typical of your Eastern European um, standards bathroom looks pretty nifty again that's like an Eastern European shower the um, semi circularish shape with the um, ah, two opening doors in the middle but yeah well, I've got three nights here so um, it'll do um, the bed ooh that's pretty soft so I should get a good night's sleep too well that's my view sort of overlooks the park I'm actually looking for somewhere to get some lunch well it's a late lunch it's about uh, getting on two o'clock now I don't want to travel too far from the hotel, I don't want to get lost. I have got the address with me, so hopefully somebody can point me in the right direction, if I do. We might see that statue again in a couple of days. I've got a city tour booked. But i still got to find somewhere to have lunch. There are a few places up here that might be good. Well, there are more tourists than I thought there would be here. Not as many as Kiev, but I've seen quite a few in the last few minutes. I must be in the main street now. Sorry. Excuse the noise. Um, I'm at this place and I'm going to be having um, a lasagna Ukrainian coca-cola I notice they don't give ice here the, uh, the water quality is um, not very good in a lot of parts of Ukraine they recommend you not to drink it um, they gave me ice in Kiev so I'm assuming um, the water in Kiev is safe here's my lunch Spaghetti Bolognese. Not the lasagna I wanted, but that was a pretty good lunch. I'm heading back to my hotel now. Probably not going to see anything more today. I'm just going to take it easy, relax. I've got a big day tomorrow. So from Lviv, Ukraine. God bless until I see you tomorrow. You all behave now. Bye.
just thought I'd share that with you. All right, see you again.